Hey guys, what's up? I'm CJ and welcome back to my galaxy. Today it is my Dear 2024 video. I do these annually. I know that because there's a lot of new people here, um, this is something that I change how I do every single year. This year, um, I, I kind of have settled on what I'm going to do for this video. It started off as like a short film sort of video on an old channel that I had and it's evolved into like predictions of what I'm going to do in what's going to happen on YouTube in 2020 or in the following year and what I'm going to do personally for my channel. So I thought how I was going to design this year's video is that I've started, um, I'm going to start journals in like journals to keep track of different things. Like I'm going to do a reading journal and then a personal journal, that sort of thing. Not like, um, dear diary today, I did this. Not like that. Like I'm, you know those like aesthetic little like trackers, tracking journals that people do on, on like Pinterest and TikTok and stuff? That's what I'm going to do, except it's not going to be as aesthetic because it's me and I'm not that aesthetic. Um, but they're going to look, I'm going to, I'm going to personalize it. It's going to look super cute, but um, this is going to be like a goals sort of journal. And at the back, I'm going to do a, hold on, um, 2024 bingo card that I did kind of like last year um I don't know I think it's in a pile of papers on my desk where I'm looking um but I can't be bothered getting it so when and I got a bunch of the 2023 bingo things wrong because I just went really dramatic with it and that's also what I'm gonna do this year with it so it's essentially like YouTube drama um what's gonna happen and uh, what trends are going to happen on social media that sort of thing and i'm going to discuss that while i'm writing my ideas for the 2024 bingo i'm going to discuss what what's happened on my channel what i'm going to be doing in the new year so what i'm doing is so i have three of them right i'm going to tell you guys what i'm going to do for my journals and if you guys want like an update a, a journal tour or something in a future video let me know um so this one is going to be my like goals for the year so it'll have like personal goals career goals i wrote it down somewhere i've written down um oh. i've written down like manifestations writing goals so i have like a um work in progress novel that i have at the going at the moment that i'm gonna document my growth on how many like words i've written in each chapter short stories so I can do my writing practice, um, how many words I've written in total all year. Then I'm going to do like a YouTube um, subscribe account that I can show on here as well. Um, obviously my 2024 bingo career, it's also going to have those sort of like, because uh, I'm a university student, I'm going to be doing like university goals, um, my personal brand, which is something that I'm starting to grow on YouTube. And my personal brand in involves like social media, writing, freelancing, uh, that sort of thing. I keep saying that sort of thing. That's just how I speak. So that's what's going to go on this one. And I have, these ones look the same because I don't plan ahead that, that well. So deal with it, I guess. The one that looks exactly the same, this one's going to be my health journal, but I won't get too into detail with this one on the internet because, you know, personal things. This one's going to be my reading journal, the nice yellow one. Yellow is my favorite color. Um, this one, this is like my favorite sort of yellow. This, um, my walls are yellow. Um, I've had a friend mention that in videos, it, my walls literally look green. I'm sorry, but they're, they're, they're yellow. They're a lemon yellow, but this kind of yellow is my favorite. So I thought since there's little bananas in it, which is so cool. Um, it was a bit of a surprise when I opened it. I was like, oh, okay, fun. It's good to know. Um, but I'm gonna turn it into my reading and writing journal. Maybe writing, maybe just reading, but uh, I'm gonna keep track of a bunch of things. I'm also annotating novels at the same time. So when I annotate novels, I might keep track of that, how many pages I annotated that day. I'm also gonna be making videos about annotating uh, novels. I'm starting with the Hunger Games in the new year, which will be coming next Wednesday I think and they'll be showing up every so often so stay tuned for that if I know a lot of people subscribe to me for most people on this channel subscribe to me for uh, the Hunger Games content I really appreciate everyone joining this channel I'm trying to get to a thousand subscribers so please 
do subscribe if you want more Hunger Games content, reading, writing. I also do some video games as well. So since like 90% of my subscribers um, are for the Hunger Games, uh, are you going to be getting lots of that sort of content? I'm going to be delving into both the book and movie world and all the lore for that sort of stuff. Should not be waving around scissors at all. This is my 2024 bingo card. I'm going to glue this into this journal here at the back of this journal. Um, so I don't know, well, how should I do this? If it turns out wonky, um, whoops, oh, uh, that's not totally straight, is it? Oh well. <laughs> what can you do about that? I told you guys I was not going to be aesthetically journaling. So in the past two months, my channel has grown um, quite a bit. In, it's not like a lot in the terms of YouTube, but in terms of my life, it, it's a, quite a bit. I've gotten about 500 subscribers in the past two months. And that is insane growth, personally, for me. The reason for that, obviously, is because of the Hunger Games, the whole renaissance uh, thing that happened on mostly TikTok and social media, just in general, with the new movie coming out. Um, so, I, you know, I, I happened to be posting the Hunger Games at the same time because I was so excited for it to come out that I was like, I am just going to post Hunger Games content and see what happens. Surprisingly, my Is Rue the Mockingjay video did a lot better than I expected it to be to do. Um, it, it, it had a few hundred uh, views and then not long after that, I had one that reached 60,000 views, which was insane. It's still getting thousands of views a week, which is just crazy. This is as close as it's going to get. I think that's good enough. Okay, I'm just gonna glue it in the middle there. So as I was saying with my Hunger Games content, I'm planning a lot of cool things for, I'm, I have a video this Friday coming out about Mags' games. And then I have, you know, Hunger Games Hot Takes, something that I, I'm hoping will get a lot of views is going to be the um, Catching Fire in-depth analysis because I have to analyze the rest of the series. I'm obviously going, I've already done the Hunger Games, the first movie, and then I'm going to do Catching Fire. And I know a lot of the fandom, um, their favorite movie is Catching Fire. Right. That should be good, hopefully. And we'll just fill it in. I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to cross out the middle part though. So if you guys are here because of the Hunger Games, welcome. There's going to be plenty of Hunger Games content throughout the year, especially in January that I'm planning. Just because the renaissance of the Hunger Games is over doesn't mean I am not completely obsessed with it. Still, I do an annual reread every year. So that's going to be happening. I'm going to be making content about that uh, later in the year and in January when I'm annotating the novel. Um, if anyone else does an annual reread of The Hunger Games, uh, please let me know. I'd love to hear about you guys being in the same boat as me. Alongside there being plenty of content, Hunger Games content, I'm going to be posting different kinds of series uh, because I also, you know, read books. I'm a writer as well. I read other novel series and I play video games, although it's mostly cozy video games. I'm trying to get more into different kind of videos, games that my friends play. I mostly play things like Stardew Valley, Minecraft, Sims, you know, um, I wanted to do that um, unboxing game. Unboxing? Is that what it is? You know when you move, there's, it doesn't matter. Cozy games is where I am at and that's what I like to play, but I'm trying to broaden my horizons when it comes to different video games. Uh, I recently downloaded Phasmophobia. If anyone's interested in seeing gameplay for that and me playing with some of my friends. I'm thinking about doing this thing where uh, every kind of six months I'll do like a week where I post a new series, kind of like a pilot week, and at the end of the week you guys can vote on which series you want to see stay. I think that'd be kind of interesting to do maybe every six months where I can just just throw out some experimental ideas, see if that lands or not, and give me a better idea of what my audience wants to see. If you guys have any suggestions, any um, films, books, video games you want to see me do series on, let me know in the comments down below. So what I'm putting down on my 2024 bingo, so far I only have one screen, that's I Become a Famous YouTuber. Um, maybe, let's see, um, what, what else? I, I think there would be 
I I'm waiting for some sort of really, really big drama to happen. You remember when um, Bias Sister happened? I'm thinking like big like that again, you know, and that a whole of YouTube is hearing about, you know, other than Colleen Ballinger. I'm, I'm talking like really petty drama that everyone's laughing at and not anything super serious. Um, I want to say another by sister, um, but yet again, that's kind of really serious allegations. Um, like the first drama get in, you know, the first, I don't know if you guys, if any of my audience knows about that sort of stuff, but the first drama get in, I'm waiting for something like really big to happen that really, oh, I guess, I guess all drama is kind of serious now. So it's not, I thought of like Logan Paul when he like changed YouTube and James Charles changed like not being able to see the subscriber count and Logan Paul changed like how many subscribers you need to be able to be monetized. But that was like really serious stuff. Maybe not petty, but really serious. But that's like, I can't laugh at that because it's really serious. But at the same time, like that's what happens on YouTube now. And it's really sad that so many YouTubers are so corrupt. I'm just gonna write down sister, by sister 3.0 because there was a second thing that happened that took out Shane Dawson and Jeffree Star along alongside Jeffree Star, uh, James Charles, whatever. You guys know what I mean. I'm gonna do by sister 3.0. Just for fun, I'm gonna put down World War Three. Just, you know, um, just so I can have bragging rights of the world is going to end. As for the rest of my YouTube channel and the content I'm going to be posting, uh, it's going to involve Mondays are going to be video games, Wednesdays are books, films are on Fridays, and then live streams on weekends. The live stream at the moment is going to be about Minecraft, uh, which is going to be a, a, a SMP called Sigma SMP. Uh, which is kind of an inside joke between my friends and I, uh, which I will explain when the SMP starts. If you guys are interested in video games, that sort of thing, um, more of like cozy streams, cozy video games, then join in on the streams. There will also be some where I'm just sitting and discussing um, Hunger Games or a latest release of a book, a book that I recently read, um, you know, or recent blockbusters and films, Hollywood blockbusters or films I'm interested in. I know the Umbrella Academy is coming out I think next year so I'll be discussing that. The Umbrella Academy is one of my favorite TV series. I'm very excited to be watching that and making videos about that. If you're interested in the Umbrella Academy uh, please watch those and subscribe. You know what would be really interesting for 2024 if like a new genre or a new wave of YouTubers came in? Um, I'm gonna do those in two separate boxes. Um, new genre of, or new community of YouTube? No, hang on. New, new genre of, new video genre. You know, like video essays, video games. Um, you guys know what I mean by new genre. And then I'm gonna also do in like kind of the same row, like new, new community, new um, YouTube group. Can't be, no, if a YouTube group happens, that can't be. I think that's so like pre-2020 new YouTube group maybe like new new genre on YouTube and new community on YouTube does that make sense maybe I'll just write down new group on YouTube and I'm not talking about like um what was it called the sister squad the vlog squad I'm talking more like just a group of people doing like a series together like the dream SMP not that I want the dream SMP back I never watched that no offense don't attack me. I just think it'd be really interesting if another one of those happened. Do you guys want to see a topic discussed on a live stream in a video, mostly live stream because that's what I was discussing before, uh, then let me know um, if you want a, to see a game live streamed. Also let me know. I'm always open to suggestions, especially on Discord. We have a Discord uh, server that should be linked in the description or in the comment section somewhere. You guys join the discord it's called um sigma server i think uh because of the inside joke once again you guys get to find out about the inside joke if you join the discord server you'll be able to discuss anything to do with books films video games especially the hunger games if you join the discord server what else do i think would happen let's think the world what's gonna happen in the world that would 
be really cool, not depressing like World War Three. What would be like really cool that could happen? Maybe, let's see, Mr. Beast plants more trees. What's the, what's what's along the lines of that? That maybe he does plant more trees again. Mr. Beast, I don't know much about Mr. Beast. I'm sorry, I apologize in advance. I'm not a huge fan of Mr. Beast. Oh, what if a new indie production company becomes really famous? That'd be cool. Oh, you know what I thought of? Something, okay, let's write down, okay, I'm gonna write down both. Indie production company becomes really famous, uh, I should, probably because of TikTok, but I'm not gonna write that part down. And then um, BookTok community gets into a mega scandal because we've, BookTok has gotten into some drama recently that's not good. But I'm talking like mega scandal that blows up book talk. Okay, I'm gonna come back with all my squares filled up. Just okay, it, it'll be quick for you, but it'll be like half an hour for me of just thinking. All right, to end off this video, let's discuss the finalized version of just my little eye. Finalized version of the 2024 bingo. So let's go, I'm gonna go through the ones that I discussed before as well at the same time. I'm just gonna list them all off. React in the comments if you guys think I I went too far. <laughs> TikTok goes the Vine route. New genre on YouTube. I become a famous YouTuber, me, CJ's Galaxy. New YouTube group, climate change kills us all just because I want bragging rights for that one in uh, the afterlife. Trump wins election and runs country from prison cell just because I really am curious to see how that would work. Sigma SMP becomes mega famous, which is my creative SMP I'm starting next weekend. A publishing house has a big scandal, Mr. Beast scandal, and he gets entirely cancelled because of it. I, me, myself and I, CJ's Galaxy, hit 1 million subscribers, which would be great even though we're just at just above 500 right now but th that doesn't matter um next one Putin dies um I think we'd all love that huge book talk scandal uh because they get into book talk well the bad side of book talk some of them are are, are right they give good book reviews world war three once again I want bragging rights new top individual youtuber instead of like Miss the Beast at the top, it's someone new that is some that doesn't um seem like they're they're bad. Mr. Beast just rubs me the wrong way. I don't know. Mr. Beast plants more trees. Why always about Mr. Beast? Calm down. I don't even watch him. Every new Hollywood blockbuster movie flops, which I think we came pretty close to this year because blockbuster movies so there should be one a year. And that's why they did so well. That's why they were blockbusters. Huge new famous indie production company. I would love to see like a really good movie from an indie, uh, indie production company that go really mega viral. That'd be so cool to get a really good movie that becomes like a cult classic. That'd be so cool. Netflix majorly messes up beginning their downfall. Although I think their downfall has already been, um, it's already started. Major movie remake gets scrapped. I think that would be really interesting. Plus, I do not want the How to Train Your Dragon remake. I just, I don't see why they're doing it. And it's, it's no. I just, it doesn't work. The CGI is going to look so bad. Another big YouTuber retires. Trump dies. By Sister 3.0. King Charles dies. Queen Camilla dies. So that's my... 2024 bingo and I swear I am going to get all of them right at the end of the year maybe hopefully the Sigma SMP one is both my worst nightmare and the best thing that could happen so maybe maybe it'll go super famous and everyone will be in on the inside joke between me and my friends so guys I hope you enjoyed listening today about everything I've been doing and what I will be posting next year uh, dear 2024, uh, don't be as bad as this year or the past three years. Give us something to hold on to, something to hope for, because I am sick of the New Year's sucking. Please give me something. Anyways, guys, that's the end of the video today. I hope you enjoy if you did please like and subscribe comment down below anything you'd like me to do in the new year any videos if you'd like to see me do that pilot week that i discussed earlier once again i hope you guys enjoyed 
this video. I've been CJ and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!